All right, you guys have been asking about this pedal for like three years now. Well, now, thanks to Kili Electronics, here it is. God knows it took me a while to get this one and I know you're pissed because I am just covering this pedal First of all, if you're just getting into pedals Get this one and I'm gonna prove it to you with my settings You can just copy them and since there are like thousand reviews about this pedal I'm gonna divide this video into parts. You know me. I'm just gonna deep dive into everything I will only be using this pedal and a delay which I will explain why I'm gonna use it in a while All right, first of all, we gotta cover some dark side of the moon tones. I mean earlier stuff, you know Pre Big Muff. You're gonna see the settings on the screen and let's hear them.
problem with this pedal that you can't use delay with flange or uh, you know phaser you can just use one of them but everybody has delay on their pedal board so uh, is this a big issue i don't think so this can deliver a lot of stuff and let's deliver some of the a lot of stuff that i mentioned uh, regarding wish you were here and animals <coughs> Thank you. 
Alright, we've covered some grounds. I mean, the pedal's name is Dark Side, which means it's gonna cover Dark Side of the Moon type tones. But no, we can just use this pedal for later stuff too, you know, the walls, the final cut. I mean, you heard dogs and pigs, right? They both sounded awesome. They both sounded so good. Now let's use this pedal to cover David Kimmel's 70s, late 70s and early 80s type of tones. Let's hear it. Alright, one pedal to cover every Pink Floyd tones, right? No, of course not. We're just gonna have to get David Kimmel's solo work too. You know, uh, let's play In Any Tongue, you know, from Pompeii. And, of course, some of my favorite 2006 performances, uh, Take a Breath is uh, one of them. Uh, let's hear a couple.
All right, that's it for me because we've covered a lot of grounds. You can just copy everything you see in this video, the settings and everything. Of course, you need to tweak a little bit depending on your amp, which is only natural. But as you can hear, we can cover from early 70s to 2016 and hopefully 2024 if David Kilmore releases an album. And as you guys can see, I only use this pedal and a delay. Check the pinned comment for everything you need to know about this pedal Tutorials, tabs, backing tracks, everything you need to know is below. Also, if you're wondering why I am using EMG pickups, just check this video out to see a comparison between EMG Active pickups and my Texas Special Vintage pickups. And check this video out if you want to know my top 10 David Gilmore solos with tabs. Yes, I know, I say this all the time, but the service is unbelievable. I'll see you guys there.